Think you need magic to be a hero in an anime? Think again. We challenge you to watch these 10 anime series featuring protagonists who kick butt without a single magical power. You might just find your next favorite show. Kicking off our list at number 10, we've got Akashic Records of Bastard Magic Instructor. Get this, the main guy, Glenn, is a magic teacher who can't do magic. Like, what? But hold up. This dude's actually an ex-assassin who's all about strategy. So yeah, no fancy spells, just pure smarts. Pretty cool, huh? All right, let's hit number nine with Handyman Saitu in Another World. So this regular dude, Saitu, he's just minding his business fixing stuff when boom, he's in a whole fantasy world. But check it out, instead of magic, he's rocking his handyman skills. Fixing dragon lairs, MacGyvering potions. This guy's proving you don't need spells when you've got a wrench and some crazy ideas. Pretty rad, right? Yo, check out number eight. A certain magical index. This city's full of super-powered peeps, but our guy Tuma's got a weird deal. His hand? It just shuts down other people's powers. No fancy magic, just a dude with a built-in nope button. Talk about playing life on hard mode. Coming in at lucky number seven, we've got UQ Holder, meet Tota, the kid who can't die in a world full of magic. No spells, no problem. This dude's all about training hard and thinking fast. Imagine fist fighting a wizard. That's Tota's Monday. Pretty wild, right? Yo, number six is I parry everything. This show's wild. Our hero's superpower? Just blocking stuff. For real. No flashy magic, just epic dodging. It's like if your little brother's I'm not touching you game became a legit fighting style. Crazy, right? All right, number five on our list is Chivalry of a Failed Knight. Picture this, a magic school where one dude can't do magic. That's icky, but hold up. This guy's a sword master. He's out here schooling magic users with just a blade and crazy skills. Talk about flipping the script. Yo, check out number four, Wistoria Wand and Sword. This world's all about magic, but our guy's like, nah, I'll stick with my sword. He's out here taking on wizards with just a blade and some big brain moves. It's like bringing a knife to a magic fight and winning. All right, check this out. So there's this world where everyone's got magic, right? But then there's MASH. This dude's like, magic? Nah, I'll just lift weights. Can you believe it? He's basically a walking, talking, muscle-bound wrecking ball in a world of wizards. It's like if Rocky Balboa was a magician's worst nightmare. All right, check this out. <laughs> so there's this magic school, right? Everyone's throwing fireballs and stuff. But then there's this dude, Tatsuya. He's like the worst magician in the school, officially. But don't be fooled, this guy's a total brain. He knows magic inside and out, but in a totally different way. It's like he's a science guy trapped in a magic world. He's basically using math to beat wizards. All right, check this out. So this dude, Asta, lives in a world where everyone's got magic except him. Can you believe that? Zero magic power. But don't feel bad for him, because he's a total badass. No magic, he just gets super strong instead. It's like if Superman was all muscle and no flying. This show's all about proving you don't need magic to be a hero. So, we've been talking about these anime dudes who kick butt without magic. You know, like MASH, the muscle-bound beast, or Tatsuya, the brainiac wizard. They're basically proof that you don't need spells to be a hero. Want to see more awesome characters like these? Hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Let's chat about who your favorite non-magic hero is.